Welcome to Tint Laws, established in 2006. We pride ourselves on being the first established authority for all information regarding window tint laws. Today, clarity meets compliance in the world of automotive customization. In this video, we're gearing up to navigate the essentials of window tinting laws. Get ready to dive into the do's and don'ts. From legal tint limits and approved tint colors to the consequences of stepping outside the lines. Whether you're a seasoned driver or new to the road, we've got the guidelines to keep your ride looking sharp and staying on the right side of the law. Let's roll. Welcome to Idaho, where the blend of safety and customization comes to life through the window tinting regulations established back in 1992. Let's take a closer look at these laws, designed to ensure safety while catering to personal style. First off, if you're behind the wheel of a sedan in Idaho, you're allowed to tint the top six inches of your windshield, a rule crafted to maintain your visibility for safer driving. Now, focusing on the front side windows, the law mandates they must allow in more than 35% of light. This requirement is set to ensure that drivers have adequate visibility and law enforcement officers can see inside the vehicle, promoting safety for everyone on the road. When we explore the regulations for the backside and rear windshields, there's a bit more leeway. Here, Idaho permits 20% tint darkness, offering additional privacy and a shield from the sun's glare, which is particularly beneficial in the state's sunnier locales. Shifting gears to SUVs and multi-purpose vehicles, the rules adapt slightly. On the windshield, only the top six inches can be tinted and front side windows must allow more than 35% of light. For the back side and rear windows, you're granted the freedom to choose any tint darkness. It's an accommodating approach for those who value privacy and UV protection. However, there's a spectrum of tints that Idaho strictly prohibits. Tints in red, yellow, and amber are off limits, as they're designated for emergency and law enforcement vehicles, ensuring clear communication and safety on the roads. Disregarding these guidelines could lead to a fix-it ticket, with penalties reaching up to $50 for a first offense. It's a reminder that these laws are in place to safeguard the well-being of all road users. Idaho also provides accommodations for medical conditions requiring darker tints than normally permitted. For individuals needing such an exemption, MyIRx can assist you in receiving a medical exemption over a simple Zoom call. The process has been made straightforward and accessible. A letter from a licensed physician detailing the necessity for darker tints due to a specific medical condition can grant you this exemption. This provision underscores Idaho's commitment to ensuring the health and safety of its drivers. There you have it, a comprehensive overview of Idaho's window tinting laws, from legal limits and color restrictions to exceptions for health reasons, all crafted with the dual goals of safety and personal preference in mind. For further details or to seek an exemption, be sure to follow the provided link. Staying informed is key especially when it comes to navigating the intricacies of state regulations. Keep safe, stay informed, and enjoy Idaho's scenic beauty and roads responsibly. Until next time. So that wraps up our guide on navigating the ins and outs of window tinting laws. If you're looking to find the perfect tint shop near you, look no further. Visit Tinting Near Me, the world's largest tinting directory, boasting over 16,000 tint shops. Whether you're seeking expert advice, top-notch service, or just the right shade to comply with the law, Tinting Near Me has you covered. Click the link in the description below to find your nearest professional tinting service today. Drive safe, stay legal, and add that sleek look to your vehicle with ease. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to like, subscribe, and turn on notifications for more helpful videos.